Well, police are searching for the woman who stole a car in Van Nuys with a baby in the back seat. They found the baby still in the car. That child is safe, but the woman is still on the loose. Cake on Ice, Dave Lopez, live in Van Nuys, where mom and baby were reunited. Dave? Well, there's not much to go on, as you're right, uh, Sandra. The woman who stole that car, we do not know. Police do not know if she knew that the baby was in the back seat, but regardless, she's still on the lam. Behind me is the Van Nuys uh, substation for the LAPD, where the mother and the little 11 month old baby boy were reunited. The little boy is fine. He was checked out of the hospital. He's okay. And mom, a very young mother, is breathing a sigh of relief. Did you leave the car running and, and go inside? Yeah. How long, how long was the car unattended, roughly? Uh, like seven minutes. Paula, she asked us not to use her last name, is reunited with her son at the Van Nuys Police Department, 11-month-old Leo. And she said what happened this morning made her heart stop. How far away were you? Just like, like maybe eight, ten feet away. She explained to me that she was picking up her older son to go to the doctors on Galt Avenue in Van Nuys. She kept the motor running, and little Leo was in the back seat in his car seat. She said she kept looking at the car to make sure that little Leo in the back seat was okay. All of a sudden, she said, someone was in the car. She didn't know it was a woman, and the car was gone. She started running after the car, yelling. And then she realized it was hopeless, and then she dialed 911. I was just praying and hoping for the best and having faith that God would find him. Less than two hours after all this happened, her prayers were answered, thanks to this alert plumber less than two miles away. Well, we were at work and we saw a baby in the car, so it didn't look right. Ralph Salajanian said the windows were down and the baby looked like he had just awakened. And he knew something was wrong, so he called 911. Said, I want to grab the baby. The dispatch told me, wait, uh, wait, let me check the license plate before you grab the baby. So we, I, uh, she checked the license plate. She said, oh my God, don't go near the car. He said less than a minute later, sirens blaring, the LAPD arrived and little Leo, was rescued. I wanted to hug the baby, but I <laughs> well, You feel like a guy who did something really special? Yeah, of course. Everybody's supposed to do that once they see a baby in the car. So you had no idea who this woman was? No. No no axe to grind against you? Nothing? No, nothing. Just out of the clear blue? Yes. Are you ever going to do this again? No. That's why it's a learning lesson. And for everyone also, like, to not do that, you know, even if you're going in your house for a second to get anything like a sweater or their diaper bag or something to take them with you. As she said, lesson learned. The search goes on for that woman. As you can see by that smiling face, little 11 month old Leo's doing just fine. Yeah. Back to you. <laughs> He's a cutie, and I yeah. bet mom's not going to take her eyes off him for a while. All right, Dave, thanks.